Hi, Jim with Dynastic Technologies. Today we're going to be doing a short demonstration of our product called Pan Seal, which seals and restores leaking and rusted drain pans. We've had a lot of requests through the website to show how the product works and how to apply it, and hopefully we'll answer those questions today. I've got a pan here. We've got a hole in it. It's probably maybe a quarter to an eighth of an inch in diameter. We're going to be filling it with water shortly, and then we'll show you how it works. The unique thing about this product is that it sets up in standing water, which means you don't have to pull the pan. There's no surface prep required. If you've got a leak in the drain pan, you simply apply this product as close to or near the, the hole as possible, and it will seal the leak immediately and permanently. It comes in a standard cop gun cartridge. You're going to need a standard cop gun, which we've got here, and I'm going to show you that all you do, it is a two-part epoxy, but there's no mixing required because it comes with a mixing nozzle, which you just simply apply like this, and screw this back down. Insert it like this into the cog gun. I think we're about ready to go. Let's get some water in this pan and show how it works. Okay, as you can see, we've got water in the pan now. We've got the leak right here, and you can see, you should be able to see. Stop, can you get a close-up of this? Sure. You should be able to see that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to apply the pan seal in close. I know I can see where the leak is. You may not be able to see where it is. If you know the general area, you're going to want to apply it, you know, in that area as close to the leak as possible. It will run and self-level underwater. So, and I'm not going to put this right over the leak. I'm going to put it near so that it kind of runs and you'll know when it gets there because you'll see it stop. It has sort of the viscosity of honey, maybe a little bit thicker than that. I think honey would probably run a little bit faster, but there we go. Now I'm going to continue to put a little bit more in there, but as you can see the leak has stopped and it will continue to level out, self-level under the water and it will set up, and that's going to take about, here, I'm going to go ahead and stop right there, but that'll take about, oh, two to three hours, depending on the temperature, and as hot as it generally is. There we go. Get this all over everything. You're going to look at two to three hours before you get to a point like this. Scott, can you get a close-up of this? This is what the product looks like set up. This Right here is just styrofoam. You can see it's stuck to it. We put this in a little styrofoam uh, form, and that's what it looks like. Here, can you get this? I mean, mm -hmm. how hard it is. And it basically becomes part of the metal. So there you have it. I hope that helps. If you have any other questions, you can find on our website the Frequently Asked Questions, the MSDS, the data sheets. And if that doesn't help you, if you have another question, you can... Calls. What is the website? www.dynesic.com www.dynesic.com D-Y-N-E-S-I-C Thanks, Jim. Appreciate it.